What's up guys, how you all doing? Cosmic Carry here, I'm bringing up a World of Tanks video and for those of you that are new here, please feel free to subscribe to my channel and for my regular viewers, hello, hello, welcome one and all and welcome to my review of the AMX 1375 uh, the Tier 7 French Scout Tank part of the tank line leading up to the Bat Chat, the Tier 10 Bat Chat and uh, this is part of the AMX series. Uh, this is the middle tank in the AMX series. There's three tanks in the AMX series. The Tier 6 12T, the AMX 1375, and uh, which I'm reviewing right now, and the uh, Tier 8 AMX 1390, I believe. So there's three tanks in this AMX line, and it's a very, very... Um, it's uh, you you kind of being prepared for the bat chat basically and uh, you're being uh, tested out you kind of getting used to the order loaders etc etc and these uh, free tanks uh, part of the AM AMX series are all very very uh, similar and uh, this tank AMX 1375 is the middle tank in this um, in the AMX series and uh, it is, you know, you've done this before with the 12T, you know, we've done this before. They've, it's very, very similar to the previous tank. And the next tank in line is very, very similar to this one. So you're kind of used to it. You've done it all before. Deja vu somewhat, etc, etc. And um, I'm not going to do that much of an in-depth review of this tank because... Like I said, it's very similar to this 12T. You know, there's not that much of a change. You know, you have uh, moved up a tier. You know, so this uh, this tank uh, basically, you're playing up to uh, to uh, tier 10. You know, which is different from the previous tank, and um, uh, the hit points have gone up. Uh, they've gone up from 600 to 900. Engine power has gone up. Uh, it's 250 uh, speed limit pretty much the same uh, a bit better traverse speed etc etc hull armor pretty much the same 40 at the front 20 at the sides 15 at the rear uh, turret armor 40 20 20 etc etc and uh, I'll talk about the guns in a, in a second view range has gone up by 10 signal range has jumped dramatically and <clears throat> But when it it's a very strange, very weird when it comes to the guns because initially, the uh, there's just a 75 mil equipped with the 1375, uh, just like with the previous tank, the 12T. But what you're initially given is a downgraded um, uh, 75 mil. It's a it's a downgraded 75 mil, and um, and if you want the gun that you had um, on the 12T, you're going to have to work for it. Because initially, what you're given is a, a downgraded version of the 75mm that you had on the 12T. And um, the second package, also, it's still, you know, it's the SA-49, pardon me. It's, the S, it's called the SA-49. On the 12T, on the previous tank, you had the SA-50, uh, much higher uh, pen and uh, slightly higher damage. And if you want the SA-50 on the on this tank, on the 3075, you really have to work for it because it's not even available um, on the first package. It's available on the on the second package, and not only that, that that second package is actually optional you don't have to um you you don't have to grind it out you don't you don't have to unlock it you could possibly if you wanted to simply move on to the next tank in line bypass it altogether and move on to the 1390 tank the tier 8 so it's it's totally up to you on on the tier uh, 8 tank the 3090 you do get the upgraded 75 mil but you also get a 90 mil you know, so you also get a 90 mil. So there's a difference there. So, in my personal opinion, in my personal opinion, I have unlocked, you know, this kick-ass gun, you know, the SA50 on this tank, and I'm gonna do.
do some demos on um, uh, in battle etc etc we're using this gun but in my personal opinion don't bother unlocking this uh, tank you know if you're on this tank line you're aiming for the bat chat you know just move on to the next tank and uh, don't bother up, uh, unlocking this upgraded gun because you've played with it before you know you had it on the 12t you know what it's like and uh, you know you, you're not here to you know play the amex uh, 1375 to its full potential to its max you you're here to reach the bat chat basically so you want to be moving on to the next tank in line don't bother unlocking it my personal opinion and just move on to the next tank move on to the the 1390 that is my personal opinion so take it how you want it totally up to you and um, like I said this tank is very very similar to the 12T if you want a more in-depth like review of this tank um, I'm gonna put a link right now up on screen and etc um, etc et let's get into some gameplay shall we let's get into some gameplay So what to say? What to say about the uh, you know the uh, 1375, the AMX 1375? What there? Is, what, what what is there to say? We've been here before. We know how it works. You're a quick like a uh, quick light French order loader, and uh, there there is uh, one positive uh, to moving up a tier, which is you do get six extra shells. You do actually get six extra shells and I did mention that on a 12T on a previous tank in a previous uh, tier that you know you, you ran the risk of running out of shells and those the six extra shells you know one extra clip you know it makes all the difference it really does you know you literally you don't have to worry about running out of shells anymore you know or at least I never did you know I was always good to go I was no problem I didn't have to you know micromanage you know usage of my shells I just let them rip where I, you know where I needed in the previous tier it was 30 shells in this tier in this tank in the 1375 it's uh, 36 shells so that is definitely definitely a bonus so same thing again you know use your speed to your advantage you know catch those guys the bad guys with their pants down and it's all about side shots and shots into the rear you get you know close to attack nah he's not gonna touch you you know he's not gonna touch you I know somebody's behind me there's a sniper behind him about to let it. but um but you look at that KV-1S, you know, you catch him, you know, from behind or from the side, you do the ring of death around them, you know, there's literally, there's nothing they can do, and you've got that fantastic 75 mil if you choose to get it, and that, that's what I have on this, you know, I think the downgraded uh, 75, it's like 110 pen, this one's 144, so my advice to you is continue on to the next tank, because the next tank in line, the AMX 1390, it's exactly the same as this one. You do to get a 90 mil gun, but that's a totally different story, you know. That's a, you know, at the end of the day, this grind has been fun. I have been using free XP for the packages, etc., etc., but it has been fun. But I, I don't know, the, you know, it would have kind of you you would have felt like you were stuck in a rut with all these guns and they're very repetitive and you're going back and forth over them and you understand what i'm saying you want to be moving up you want to be moving up even though these tanks are fun there's three of them they're very very similar and it kind of feels like uh, i think you, you're playing in one tank forever and ever and ever you want to reach the lorraine the t9 lorraine and you want to you know you want to move up as, as quick as you can to the bat chat so my advice to you is you know s s skip the upgraded 75 mil move on to the amx uh, uh 1390 but you know it's up to you, you know, it's a free world and all that nonsense and uh, so let's, I've mentioned this before, you know, 
let's let's uh, w what do you do in this tank you know you hide behind the heavy hide behind the heavies and just approach us you know shoot over their shoulders and take advantage of the quick windows to you know shoot to go there you go somebody else got the kill what can you do be smart about when it comes to reloading oh he's still alive <laughs> Maybe, ah, no. yeah, somebody did still with a kill. But um, be smart about reloading, you know. And uh, I kind of felt like, you know, in these tanks, when you're reloading, you don't have to be necessarily a waste of space. When you're reloading, be a scout, you know, do your job. I mean, be be a scout, and, you know, do your job. And um, and when when your gun is loaded, continue being a scout. But at the same time. You know, you can unload and inflict a buttload of damage, so you, you don't necessarily have to go in highs and etc. Um, etc. Et and um, you don't you don't necessarily have to go and hide and wait for your gun to reload. You know, you can still take advantage of your speed and be a scout for your team, and you know, light them up for the bad guys uh, for you, for your team, light the light the bad guys up for your team, and. See, uh, when you are shooting at someone, like I said, you know, make sure there's a, you know, one of your compadres are in front of you, you know, that way they're kind of, the bad guys are focused on them instead of you, because you, you're one shot, you know, you're going up to tier 10 now, and you get, uh, you do get into a lot of, you know, high tier games, honestly, you know. I always seem to be like the bottom of the table, the bottom of the, you know, Bottom of the matchmaking, which is fine, because um, no, 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 bad cosmic, no, 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 run away, run away, buddy, and um, which is fine because you do get a buttload of XP, buttload of points, and buttload of this when you are um, facing off against uh, 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 players who are higher tier than you, and when you are inflicting damage, you know, upon. Uh, of, you know, players uh, that are higher tier than you, so, you know, so you take a look at the tier 8, you know, I'm going to get a buttload of XP, buttload of points, because, you know, he's <laughs> a poor guy, what can I say, poor guy, <laughs> what can I say, I mean, you get, you get behind them, and your gun is fully, fully loaded, there's, you know, there's nothing that they, they can do, there's nothing that they can do, you can see uh, and now it's like 9-9 nine, nine, and I, I remember being in this game thinking you know I can be a game changer here because most of the bad guys are on low health and if I scoot in you know and there's six of them and they're all on like 100 points each I could get six kills <laughs> of course that's not gonna happen you know, nobody has that much good luck but but still you know it is totally possible you know but I'm, I'm totally thinking here you know and when you do play in this figure, especially, you know, in the, the latter stages of the game, mopping up, mopping up, you know, it's such a good tank for mopping up, you know, look at, look, 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 you know, mopping up, mopping up, you know, let me, let me sweep this under the rug for you guys, you know, kind of thing, you know, let me take care of business, but unfortunately, you know, look at this, E75, yeah. armor, armor, IS8, what is this, yeah, and, oh, ice free, pardon me. And um, you know, it's, it's you got to shoot them from the side, and you got to shoot them from the rear, and that's that. And, yeah. But it's like I mentioned this in the twelve T. It's not the end of the world, and but place first. And um, it's not the end of the world if you die. You know, it's not the end of the world if you die. It's seven thousand. You lose seven thousand. You know, coins you die so it's really you know be prepared to die be, be willing to die and you know but don't I mentioned this before you know don't that doesn't necessarily mean you should be reckless you, know, you shouldn't be reckless but let's finish the, yeah let's finish it all up, all up and we're on live oaks and I'm gonna demonstrate how to be a perfect AMX uh, 1375 driver 
And not only that, but you had to be a perfect scout for your team. You know? Don't forget, you know, you, I talk a lot about using this kind of, that kind, and how fast it goes. And you know, don't forget that you are a scout. Bottom line, you're a scout, and you need to be lighting up the bad guys for your team. You know, don't forget that. You know, don't all, all, you know always be looking out for the guy who's been you know who's driven out in the open and he's all by himself and you think oh i'm gonna get that kill you know don't forget that especially in the initial stages in the beginning stages of the game you those bad guys need to be lit up and if you light those bad guys up you know you're gonna get a buttload of spotted damage which is you know what i do in this game you know, in this game you know because the, the live oaks this little tacky kind of options are limited so I decided, you know what, I'm going to be the best scout that I can be, you know, especially when it comes to the bad guys coming into town, you know. That's one of the worst things is when you just don't know where the bad guys are in, in town and, you know, they pop out from cover and they, you know, chip away at your team's health pool, you know. So I try to be the best scout that I can be, you know. I'm risking it, you know. And uh, but I'm trying not to die at the same time. But I I, I am kind of it close. But that's big, you know that's what being a scout is all about. Yep, not lit up. But, but I, I I haven't you know I don't have my sixth sense. On the next tank in line, I'm gonna be getting uh, my sixth sense with the uh, the tank crews and fully trained. You know, so the reload speed in this game, you know, it isn't. You know what it should be, etc., etc. Et On the next tank in line, the AMX uh, 39. I'm going to be playing that tank for a long, long time because uh, I've run out of uh, free XP and all of that. So to get to the Lorraine, it's going to take me, you know, take me a while. It's going to take forever, but it's going to take me much longer than it did, you know, with the T6 and this one, the T7. You know. But. Um, but with that tank, I'm gonna be, be a in the system, so. man. <laughs> That's a that's gonna be a buttload of fun. That's gonna be a new experience. Because for two tanks now, two tiers now, it's been 75 mil, 75 mil, 75 mil. Ah. Anyhow, as you can see here, Kitnik close, trying to light up the bad guys, seeing if I can get any shots in on target. Scooting up so from building to building, I see this heavy. I want him to get Rapper. lit up, you know, for my compadres. I'm lit up, I'm lit up, who's lighting me up? Hopefully it's just that guy. Make, maybe it's proximity. E1, hello fellow water loader. <laughs> what am I getting that tank, E1? Very, very snazzy. An upgraded version of this tank. Sep, I think Shoot you need to roll that <laughs> shit up, mate. And pass along. So we're doing remarkably well here, five to two, but as, you know, but I'm definitely, I'm definitely not playing my part here. Okay. Low is on fire. I kind of move in, debating whether or not I should scoot in and get the you know, final the shot, put the nail in the coffin, some of that and he gets taken out at the last second. Okay, now we can push onwards and upwards towards the base. I can kind of lead the push, so to speak. And as soon as I get the hell out of here, and I get, I do remember this, I get very, very lucky. I was fully expecting it. Oh, you know, it should have been a hit. Nice shot, Tim, with that, uh, with my 75 mil. Fucking shit, man. And I can exhale now. Butt cheeks unclenched, most definitely. <laughs> So keep in mind the reload speed, you know, it's much longer than it should be because my crew isn't fully trained. And same thing with the 12T, the previous tank. And uh, because I don't uh, spend, I think, what is it, 1,000 gold to fully train your crew? I think that's over the top. You know, that's kind of crazy. Oh, to tell you the truth, that's kind of expensive. Yeah. And uh, all we have here is a tortoise and a heavy attempt to use the terrain to mask the approach. Man. 
get some nice shots in on his Coppola. 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 I honestly think that's a made up word. The hatch, the Coppola. He just sounds like it's, it's a lovely word, but it's very smooth word, it kind of flows off the tongue, it rolls off the tongue, Capola, anyhow, good game there, good game there, played my part, fantastic little tank, can't wait to move up to the next tank, and uh, as you can see, love those ops, really help out, you know, with moving up, you know, buying the next tank, you can see I'm choosing most of the ones that, you know, that give me silver, achieve my mastery badge, Good to go. Six senses approved. Blah blah blah. Good to go. Anyhow, look at that spotting damage. Very very nice. So, I hope you guys have enjoyed. I can't wait to move on to my next tank in line with the ninety mil. Ooh, I wonder what's that going to be like. The moving on was an upwards to the AMX thirteen ninety. So. This has been the AMX 1375, the second tank in the AMX series. Hope you guys have enjoyed. Take it easy. Capola.